Yeah! <laughs> His descendants. Except for that part. Yup, okay. I am the god of this new world! Alright, Kira. <laughs> and the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy! Oh, I forgot how much I hate his new voice. That was a lot less impressive than I was expecting it to be. The one, the only, Monokuma! Nice to meet ya! Yay! And here's his theme. <laughs> Our epic entrance from Papakuma. Yeah, Dad's awesome! You're all so freaking cute! The only reason I'm tar your tiresome antics is because you're all so cute! You and the prog is going way too long a la because you guys are cute! In fact, the very first prog was ever only short because your cutie patooties weren't there! Are you mad at us, Pops? Oh, never get mad, my cute little cubs! Oh, he's super mad! This is Monokuma. He's amazing. <laughs> Daddy is still cold in when he's angry. That's right. It's from the play of handsome bears that gets cooler as they get angrier. <laughs> it's getting interesting. Super Monokuma, Super Monokuma 2, Super Comet Monokuma 3, and finally Super Monokuma 4. You're forgetting Super Monokuma God Super Kuma. Is he? Yeah! There we go. <laughs> you joked, but... <laughs> Wait, but there's only five Kumas here. I guess Monofanny's pregnant. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, that or one of the students is secretly a Kuma. <laughs> Man, it was really fortunate about of gods that like all five Saiyans were pure of heart. Yeah, how fortunate. <laughs> anyway. I am not really mad. In fact, I gotta admit that I'm actually proud of you guys. Kids really stand out from the rest of the second generation failures of the world. No way. Not a little harsh. I'm sure there are some second generation success stories. Yeah. Yeah, I can't think of any though. Yeah! <laughs> if you can't think of any, it's because there's none worth remembering! But father remembers <coughs> everything! Holy shit! That's right, Papa Kuma! You know all kinds of useless crap! Oh man. What? <laughs> Wow, we really going in there. I love embracing my children. So cute, I just can't help myself. Usually, Rags will pull when mascots appear in sequels too much. But in this case, Rags are through the roof. All thanks to the cute Monocubs. I don't know, I kind of hate them. Yeah, they're not <laughs> great. No Tay Bear appeared. It's no ordinary Tay Bear. The spirit madness swore around that cursed thing. Crystal, I'm not a teddy bear. I'm Monokuma. And show some respect. I'm the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy for gifted juveniles. The headmaster? Be some sort of a Thomas Rob with built in AI like me. No, no, no. Yep. Yeah, the Exocells are different though. They're brainless bucket of bolts. They're mindless period killing machines that can only be controlled by us, the Ma Cubs. Thomas Roth pawing weapons platforms, certainly turning into quite the story. <laughs> I'd be like more about this killing game you mentioned. What exactly does that mean? Mm. What's so amusing? Like so far I kinda just phoned it and now I feel awkward. Aren't you students with your ultimate level times to participate in a killing game? Wait, what? Us? Here? Right now? At this time of night? 
localized entirely in the gymnasium. Yes. <laughs> Can I see it? No. You guys don't want to do it. Of course not, gentlemen. Nor hurt people. But if you've looked around the academy, then you already know, don't you? Everyone here hates bugs. Can't stand by a huge wall. And you can't escape the outside. The laws we have the exocells, you can't defy us. In other words, I have the power over life and death over each and every one of you. Sure. So you say if we don't want to die. Hey, yeah, guy king, you're like, why do friends kill each other? Oh. Uh, who said you guys were friends? No way. Guys aren't friends at all. Your enemies out to kill each other. Huh? Yeah. Wait, we're enemies. Do a lot learn from father about sarcasm. Toss bus shot me. I got real mild damn to relieve the stress. Man, Karen's just zooming around like nuts. Yep. It's because uh, there's so many characters to oh, man, yeah. zoom to. Not good with bots or gore sad situations. Dan stuff killing game. Can we just do rock, paper, scissors tournament? <laughs> Well, why don't we play a game where no one dies? Well, do you have a compassionate personality? It's so cute I barely stand it. But it's cute enough to eat. Cute enough that I want to eat it. Cute enough that you might be the first to die. <laughs> cool, cool with a stupid banter. I want to ask something. How are we supposed to kill each other? Are we getting, are you going to give us weapons? Yeah, but why are you asking? We get info from the first. We can't do anything if we don't know anything. If I have one ball, I can take out this whole damn school if I have to. <laughs> Probably. What kind of barbaric display are you envisioning? Could be more wrong. Why, at the ultimate Kai for gifted juveniles, killing games is quite their fine, sophisticated experience. Okay. Here are the killing games punctuated by class trials. Yeah, so. Alright, so if one of you maggots kills someone, you all gotta take part in a class trial. The class trial is where the right. second killer faces off against their spotless classmates. Yeah. It's where you punk ass bitches argue over who you fucking think the blackened is. After that, it's voting time! And if the majority of you idiots vote correctly, then only the blackened killer will receive punishment. Yeah, okay, yeah. Same rules as always. Yeah. Just imagining all the bloody gore makes me want to kill. Yeah, gore everywhere. Let's do this. Just keep right on living together. But if you vote for the wrong person during the class trial, the blacken gets off scot free, and all the spotless students get punished instead. So you have to kill and then go away with yeah. it. That is yep. the rules of the class trial. <laughs> <laughs> Which is a pros that would like fall apart a lot if like the smartest person in the room was the first to kill. <laughs> Cause like, can you imagine some of like the more complex trials just like, you know, coming first when you know like none of these characters. You got more coy, flirtatious, seductive, just like your old man. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Cause it's not enough to kill someone, you also have to survive the class trial. Yeah, kill without being caught and survive the trial. Sounds eerily similar to the real world. Yeah, and yeah, that's fair. The, the outside world must be masterfully designed, even at its cruelest. Listen. You know, unlike that, but I shall ask just in case. What's the punishment you mentioned before? The heck of a death game, it sure is. Yeah, it's an execution. So yeah, if you get caught, then like you die. If you like your man should go away, then everyone else is just screwed. If you do a crime, you get punished for it. That's like the most basic rule of society. But this is a killing game. So the punishment for murder is a bit more permanent. Yeah. Delta doesn't deserve this. 
Conta doesn't deserve it. Oh, man. So, yeah, that's why there's, like, you know, so many characters. Because, you know, these guys are going to start, like, dropping off super hard fast enough. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Don't get too attached, but also get nice and attached so that when the person you like dies, it's extra tragic. <laughs> and we'll be spending time with, like, the people we care about so we can get nice and attached, too. <laughs> Wait, uh, do you already have a boner? <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? No, that no, that's not great. If you have a boner, then we should be able to see it, because that's how bears work. Also, V3... V3 got a little bit more uh, vulgar than the previous <laughs> yeah. titles. Yeah, that's... Like, Monikid yelling about his boners and whatnot. Like... Yeah. Yeah, that's about the right reaction. <laughs> Malfane just puked. Yeah, I'm friggin' hard. The uh, perms give you a boner too. Puke gives you a boner. Oh, puke. You know what? Let's yeah. I'm not gonna judge. Don't you guys get murder boners? I uh, can't say I do. That was cute about that. I'm more of this burg exposition. Did heart pounding killing school semester started already? You have free reign to murder however you like, too. Like bludgeoning or stabbing. Feeling cheap? Try strangulation. Feeling lazy? Try poisoning. Whether you shoot, burn, drown, blow up, crash, electrocute, or laugh your victim to death. Yeah, that'd be a pretty fine way to go. You can use any method you like to kill anybody you like. Anyone at the ultimate academy. Maybe we should try Japanese voices. You will realize your murderous. I mean it's up to you, but Monokuma's voice yeah. is actually driving me nuts. Yeah, it's it's not great. It it can't be worse in Japanese, but maybe it is. Like it's worth it for like a trial at least. Well, like, yeah, you know, I said, like, trials and, like, a short thing, but, uh, no, nah, trial might actually be, like, a good place to test that. Because then we'd know that Monokuma would be there. I mean, we could change it now. I think we can access the school handbook. Yeah, we'll change, like, as soon. Well, you know, yeah, yeah, why not? We've got the lucky or stop playing around in the system settings. Find out next time on Danganronpa!